everybody on here sitting here inside the tiny house having my coffee it's a cool morning but it is beautiful it's sunny and today is going to be a wonderful day I'm not gonna be doing too terribly much I gotta go into town and get some ice um, I feel like making some hot dogs maybe out on the fire pit hopefully it's not a swamp down in there and um, let's see cowboy candy and make some other stuff and just chill out and enjoy not feeling sick and with it not being scorching hot outside. Here's what I got done so far. This is traditional cowboy candy. It is mostly jalapeno peppers. Yep, I leave the seeds in it because I like it spicy. I did chop up one cayenne and a few onions from my garden and um, I'm just putting that on ice. This is a little bit different. Um, I've got some pickles, some big pickles because I wanted the big jar because I want to pickle some eggs in it. And so I took a few of the dill pickles out and chopped them up and put the brine over there because I had plenty of leftover brine. And that brine is so delicious. So that's basically cucumbers, well, made into dill pickles. So I don't know how that's going to turn out. Now this one is a little unusual. I wish I had showed you that apple because it had fallen off the tree and I went and peeled it and chopped it up. You know, the tree that I've got growing out there that had that one apple on it, it got big. So I chopped that, that apple, peeled it, and I added a couple more apples in there and a couple of jalapeno peppers and a couple of onions and what else did I put in there? Oh, just all kinds of stuff. There is, it's like a chutney. Really, it's a chutney. I put some dried apricots, some dried... Uh, pineapple, some raisins, and I also put some hazelnuts in there, some chopped hazelnuts. So with the cowboy candy brine, and then I just had a little bit left, and I had a small serving of uh, apple butter, so I mixed the rest of the cowboy candy slash apple chutney uh, with a little bit of apple butter, and just put it in a jar. So I'm going to eat that first. These all have to cure for two or three weeks. So I'm going to keep them on ice. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to taste them tonight. I don't know. I may even bake that into some kind of nut loaf. I'm not sure. Let's see if the fire pit is a swamp. I brought the oven out here. Whoop! Little froggy. Whoa. Don't worry, froggy. I won't hurt you. Oh, it's underneath there. I bet you a frog is hiding underneath there. And I bet you it's a swamp down in there. So let me take this off. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Let's put in the sun and see how bad this is. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. It's pretty dry. Yeah, I think I'm going to be able to build a fire in here tonight. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. I just got a text from my neighbors over there. Um, they're the ones with the, uh, with the, uh, I am so excited. Nella, Nella, the one that Papa got with, and she's starting to have her puppies. I think there's two girls so far. They said one of them looks just like Papa. So I'm trying to be calm. <laughs> I'm trying to be calm. I am. I, I am going to take one of the puppies once it, it gets old enough. But um, So I'm just waiting to hear back from them and see how they're doing. I'm going to leave them alone. I said, well, let me know when I can come over. But they need some calmness right now. Um, oh, oh, okay. They, uh, she has, mm, oh, hang on. Okay, that was them, and um, I'm going to wait to go over because uh, Nella gets really nervous when they go in to see her, like they want to, she wants to get up or whatever, so she just needs to be in peace right now to, to deliver her puppies, and I'm so excited, I can't even believe it, so, um, well, I'm going to get this fire started in a minute here, uh, I forgot something at the store, i got to go to town again. I'm so excited. It's puppet time. I'm going to go into town, and I think I'm just going to make this a super short video today. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to film the fire. Uh, I wanted to have some hot dogs, and I forgot the bun, so i got to go get them. Um, so I think I'm just going to keep this really super short. It's Labor Day. I hope you all had a beautiful Labor Day. And uh, I'm, I can't wait for these puppies to come. I can't wait to see them. I know it may be a few days because, Nella, you know, you got to keep the mummy very calm, just like uh, Miss Bruce Ran or Baby Chickens. So, anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video.
Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.